Hey guys, welcome back to 3D Print Farm. Well, the day's finally here. Remember what we talked about in the last video about building a UV snake? We're gonna do it right now on 3D Print Farm. Okay guys, welcome back. We're going to talk a little bit about putting the LED snake together. So you're going to need a couple of items here. Uh, first of all, you're going to need a 9-volt battery connector. This battery connector I found on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description below, as well as the links to the LEDs and resistors. You're going to need a couple of pieces of wiring. You can pick this up at uh, Walmart, Radio Shack, uh, Harbor Freight. Just thin wire. You're also going to need the... LED. This is the UV LED that I uh, talked about. And you're also going to need a resistor. Now these particular LEDs came packed with the resistor, so there was 100 LEDs plus 100 resistors. And you're also going to need some heat shrink tubing. I've got some thin heat shrink tube, thin heat shrink, thin heat shrink tubing to use for the wiring, and you also need some larger heat shrink tubing. Okay, here's the pack of LEDs that I got from Amazon. There was 100 in there, and along with 100 resistors in a giant pack. And luckily, these things are matched, and they go together. So if you'll look at this, if you'll take a look at this resistor, you'll notice that it has a long leg and a short leg. It's kind of hard to see, but there's a, definitely a long leg and a short leg. The long leg is typically the anode, and the short leg is the cathode, since LEDs really don't have a positive and a negative. And since this particular circuit is a series, it doesn't really matter what side you solder the resistor on. The resistor works both ways, so it doesn't really matter which uh, side that you solder it on as well. I particularly like to solder on the anode side, which is the longer leg, but again, that's entirely up to you because this is just a simple circuit. So now here's the giant pack of resistors that I got from Amazon as well. I'm going to take one of these off. And you can see that it's quite tiny. The wiring is pretty thin. But right now I'm going to take this guy and we're going to twist it on the anode or the long leg of the LED. So what I'd like to do is yeah, just kind of bend it back a little bit. I like to twist it together to make a pretty solid connection before I solder it. After I solder it, I'll snip the legs off. So I like to get in kind of tight here uh, toward the top of the LED. You could actually, uh, if you wanted to solder the resistor down toward the end, um, you could as well, but it doesn't really matter. So again, I'm twisting it together. And I'm going to put it in my little solder station here with the alligator clip. And I'm going to tin my soldering iron up. And I'm going to solder this connection. And what you want to do is put your soldering iron on the actual wire itself and then feed the solder from below or above. And you want to make sure you have a nice shiny connection. Now I put a little bit of heat shrink tubing, the thin stuff, over the wiring and this my soldering job and then I'm going to heat it up with a lighter to kind of seal that up and now I'm going to solder the negative side and a little bit more heat shrink tubing and we'll go ahead and heat these dudes up and make them nice and tight to the wire and now what I'm doing is I have some larger heat shrink tubing I didn't have a long strip so I'm just stuck with using small pieces but uh, it helps kind of firm the uh, the LED snake up so I'm threading it on here and I've got a little tiny piece of black heat shrink tubing just at the tail end just to kind of complete the snake so I'm just kind of heating it up and shrinking everything down so you've got a nice LED snake you can see it works 9 volt battery there all right, uh, here's the five, actually I've got six here. I'll show I have six of these UV snakes. And I tell you what, I'm gonna give away five of these. So all you gotta do is put down in the comments, snake my day. 
and I'll enter you into the contest to give away five of these. You're going to have to provide your own battery. Battery is not included, but I'd like to get to 100 subscribers. Once I hit 100 subscribers, I'm going to give away five of these UE snakes. Just post in the comments below, Snake My Day. Snake My Day will get you entered into the contest to win one of my UV snakes. Okay, guys, thanks again for your time on 3D Print Farm. I hope to see you again soon. Uh, you guys take care now. Have a great day. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to 3D Print Farm. Well, the day has finally come. We're going to put together the 3D snakes. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to 3D Print Farm. Today we're going to talk about what you've been waiting for, the Yeevee Snake. <sighs> what's wrong with my hair?